What's up, guys? I fucking feel like hammered shit, like real talk. I feel terrible. I look like shit, too. Jesus Christ, man. Don't ever do drugs, kids, okay? I, I'm responding to the um, Shin Walker. He's accepting the challenge. A hashtag challenge. I, it wasn't really a hashtag, but I like I like what he did there. I should have named it that, though. Yeah, this is a creative motherfucker. Okay. Now, he said, um, I think you kind of broke the rules there, but who cares? <laughs> I know why you wanted that Brock Lesnar uh, graphic. Okay, he said, why not? Why are you being biased? Not, it was technically WWE, like, the only thing is I really don't see that many people, like, I don't see that many people, like, like, he's asking why I didn't put SmackDown and, and not just Raw. One second. Okay. Um, well, for one, uh, it, it was technically WWE, like, every show. I mean, the people, like, I, yeah, I didn't really have time to explain in my, my challenge video, uh, the people who claim like that the ones that complain about WWE like they watch anything with WWE in the title like they'll watch NXT if WWE tells them to they watch Total Divas um even if they have to watch Total Divas online <laughs> um they watch uh like anything Jabba Stars main event superstars like they watch they'll review it too like they'll watch anything that WWE slaps their name on um Legends House whatever the fuck like they'll, they'll spend their money in the company like so I pretty much meant every everybody, every show. Um the only reason I didn't like actually put the word SmackDown or whatever was because um well I meant it. I technically meant like the whole product, like I said, but not a lot of people review it like you do. Um and not a lot of people complain about SmackDown. Like they either say they don't watch it because they don't watch it, they say it's boring or or they just review it. They don't really complain that much. Um yeah, you sometimes you you sometimes complain about it. Yeah, you still, yeah, I should have asked you individually why you would still watch SmackDown. But yeah, I meant everybody, every show, okay. Then he said he watches it for Brock Lesnar. There was like a... How many years was it? Like a... Hold on. Like a... Eight-year, seven-year, eight-year period where he wasn't there. You know, um, I'm sure you, you still watched... Um, some people said the same thing. Um, I'm sure they still watched the, that half a decade he was gone also surprise appearances those are fun but like they really don't do anything for the long one a lot of people said that too uh you know and if if those surprise appearances happened in like another fed like people would complain or whatever or that that legend would get shed on oh we couldn't cut it in the wwe like rick flair was the example like he brought like hogan flair sting went walked in the impact zone and everybody shed on it so i don't know why there um then he was uh, making fun. I don't know. Like, he was saying, I'm going to put it. He says he likes the entertainment in WWE or the thing that's supposed to resemble entertainment. But he did like this voice where he was like, I'm going to talk in your words. You uh, people like the entertainment in DNA. I don't know if, like, you, you were feeling sick or something. But, yeah. Okay. I guess you like the entertainment. I think it's dog shit. I mean, there was a fucking dog in the ring like a couple weeks ago. My 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 girlfriend, my ex girlfriend, like girlfriend, but not dating. She's a girl. She's a friend. My girlfriend Guadalupe told me that that there was a fucking dog in the ring and a dead fish. What the fuck is Russo back? <laughs> I don't know there. Uh, then he says he's part of a community and that's why like they they like to get together and discuss the show, make fun, rant, laugh. You know that's fine. I guess like that that seems to be the thing in social media people join like trends and stuff like for social viral acceptance or something like that and it's always good to have that so yeah i guess um i really wouldn't put myself to that because i did that like it was fun to laugh about raw but i just i don't know i guess you focus more on the positive than the negative for me as much fun as it was having with you guys on there and i still join occasionally but Watching the show just uh, my makes my brain hurt. But yeah, that's my opinions. Uh, thank you for the video, Shin Walker, or Sean Walker, the Asian Australian, the Asian Smartbuster. And one more thing, I really love the tribute you did to um, Rowdy Roddy Piper at the end of your video. True legend, God bless him. Um, and thank you, Piper. So yeah, thank you for the video, Shin. Take care, everybody.